Habari ya asubuhi. Karibu Nairobi. We are slowly by slowly adjusting to life here in Africa. The different sights, sounds, and smells that we experience. And thankfully, we have a bakery just down the road to bless us with the smell of baked bread each morning. The kids and I have been doing a ton of homeschooling and adjusting to just the daily routine life of living in Kenya. It's been really good and it's been very different. And we asked the kids, what were some of the biggest differences and maybe some of the things that are the same? It is African people and the lighting is of course different. The cars drive on different sides of the road. Probably the biggest thing is that there's security everywhere. There's little dukas on the side of the road. The power is much less reliable. Power outs, a lot more. And then there's the streets are all dirty and then you can get coke for 30 cents, which is great. There are lots of walls. <laughs> That's it. We have been blessed to host Pastor David from the Rindili tribe in northern Kenya. He's passionate about discipleship. Amer just delivered several boxes of the audio Bible to him. He plans to use them to spread the gospel where the gospel is not welcome. From the youngs, we want to say Asante Sana. Thank you very much for being a part of our support team and lifting us up in prayer. We could not do this without you. Kuheri, tutaonana.